What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Nash here. Welcome back to the channel. And tonight, I'm going to give you guys my thoughts on the current NXT call ups, um, which are Ricochet, Alistair Black, Johnny Gargano, and the current NXT champion, Tommaso Ciampa. Um, I do, I do want to say, though, that the previous NXT call ups, Lars Sullivan, uh, Lacey Evans, Nikki Cross, um, EC3 and Heavy Machinery. Honestly, I really think that. Honestly, in my opinion on those call ups, I think for some of them, I think they made a wise choice on bringing them up. You know, you know, simply because you know, for 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 Nikki Cross, you know, obviously Nikki Cross has, you know, has sanity, and heavy and Heavy Machinery. Honestly, they they were. I think they're the one tag team that honestly needed a bit of an upgrade in the tag team division. And I think Heavy Machinery, 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 Heavy Machinery, if I could speak, um, <laughs> um, actually need. I think they were the upgrade that the tag team division needed. Um, Lacey Evans, again, just a classy lady, lady trying to class up the joint, you know? And then um, Laura, Laura Sullivan. He's still having anxiety attacks. We don't we don't know when he'll be out. He'll be in, in the ring. EC three. Well, it's EC three. I'm just I'm I'm just I'm just I'm just gonna say it like that. So with that being said, let's get into the current NXT call-ups, which are which we will start with the one and only Ricochet. Honestly, this guy is absolutely one of the most dynamic high flying superstars you will ever see in his in the in in all of professional wrestling, you know, um, you know, he he made his debut back in 1988, which actually is a pretty long time. So he, so he's got a lot of experience in the ring. Um, you know, I think uh, for Ricochet, I could definitely see a bright future uh, ahead of him. Um, as for who I would want to see him face at WrestleMania, hands down, I would love to see Ricochet one on one. With someone like maybe maybe Rey Mysterio or someone like Andrade, that would be and that would, you know matches like those would be awesome. For now, for you know and you know and um, you know and obviously his last title, you know you know the last title he had ever won, the first and last title he had won was the NXT North American title when he won it from Adam Cole at Takeover Chicago Two, I want to say. So it's a pretty. So it's been a good while. So it's been a. So it's been a couple months since he's been champion. But I could definitely see him becoming champion real soon. Um, for Alistair Black, there's not much to say about him except that it's Alistair Black. He is like one of the most hard hitting strikers you will ever see in all in all of WWE. Um, if Hideo Itami was not released. That would have been been an awesome matchup to see, but but we do have um, you know, but we do have um, sorry 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 for about that. My lamp was flickering. I guess I don't I, I don't know. Ignore that. Um. Anyway. Um. Anyway, I could I anyway I could definitely see um, see Al Alistair Black going up against someone like John Cena or or um. Yeah, honestly, I don't know. Um, honestly, I don't know, but he could really do some damage in, in WWE. And then, of course, the reunited DIY. Yeah, I saw NXT TV this past Wednesday, and if you guys saw it, Candice LeRae was P.O. not happy because of what Tommaso Ciampa did to, to Johnny Gargano at NXT TakeOver Chicago a couple of years ago. So you know that Cancel Wright is not happy. Um, we do know that that all four of these men, um, DIY, and, and then of course Ricochet and Alice of Black will be a part of the Dusty Rhodes Classic, which will culminate at NXT Takeover New York, which will be a part of um, which will be a part of WrestleMania weekend, which again I am hoping to be a part of it. Um, you know, as their YouTube ambassador, um, which again, WWE, if you guys are watching this, I called you guys, and I'm waiting. 
I am patiently waiting. Um, but yeah, so, um, as of now, uh, DIY, I think they'll, I think they'll be taking on the Undisputed, I, I think, I think they're going up against the, the Undisputed Era, and if I, and if I remember correctly, um, the team of Alistair Black and Ricochet are going up against Street Profit? I think, yeah, 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 they're going up against Street Profit, and, um, Honestly, this tournament should be very, very interesting. Interesting because you have like one, two, at, at least three, at least three tag teams in this tournament that are former tag team champions. So this is going to be a very, very in interesting tournament. But yeah, so that is just my thought. So that is going to be that is going to do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you smash that thumbs up button and do not forget to subscribe and turn on the post notification bell so you guys don't miss out on any new content that is heading your way. And on that, this is your boy Nash here, signing out.